Hey everyone, TechnoMancher here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iPhone 11 if you're getting no service, searching, invalid SIM, or your cellular service isn't working. You want to follow these steps to fix it. So let's get started. So the very first thing you want to do is pull down that control menu and put your phone on airplane mode briefly, just like that. And then go ahead and turn it off. And that does a quick network refresh. Now, if you still are having issues, the next thing to do is to check if there's a carrier update out. So go into your setting and then go to general and then about. When you're on this page, if there is an update out for the carrier, it's going to pop up and says carrier update and you're going to click on update. Now, if nothing comes up, we're going to move on to the next step, which is starting back from the main settings here. We're going to go to general and then go to BPN and device management. If you happen to be connected to a BPN, you need to turn off that BPN as it can interfere with your connections as well. Now, after that, the next thing you want to go ahead and do is if you're using a physical SIM card, we need to take that SIM card out and then reinsert it back in. You can use a SIM ejector tool that comes with the phone. If you don't have this, you can also bend a paper clip or, or your ring piece basically that can fit into that tiny hole. You're going to give a gentle push and that will pop the sim card out like that so you can see here and then reinsert it back in and what that does is make sure it's flat against that bezel it helps it again resync your service now after you did this and said let's start working if it's your very first time using a sim card make sure your phone is unlocked so in order to do that go into your settings general about and it'll say no sim restriction that means your phone it's unlocked for any carrier. Now, if it says lock, make sure you're using that same SIM from the same carrier. So if it's a AT&T phone, make sure the SIM is AT&T. If it's a T-Mobile, you would make sure that's a T-Mobile SIM or else it will not work if it's a locked phone for a specific carrier. Now, if it's still not working, starting from the main settings again, this time you're going to go to general, then go down all the way to transfer reset iPhone. Click on reset and we're going to do a network reset which will reset the network settings this will not delete any of your data so all of your photos videos apps will be on your phone and if it's still not working the next thing to do is simply restart your iphone you can do it by pulling that that control menu and then clicking on that power icon up top right here slide to power off and turn off or you can use the volume up and the side button holding it at the same time We'll bring up this menu you're going to slide to power off and then turn back on or you can also do it from your settings general and then scroll all the way down shut down shut down and then turn it back on now if it's still not working the next thing to do is go to your settings and then go to general software update and update your phone to the latest version if there is update out and lastly if none of this is working for you you're going to have to contact your phone carrier or the company that you get your phone service from to make sure your account standing is active. There's no issues on your account. Sometimes they need to add your phone to their system. You want to get them to add that or even reactivate your line to make sure there's no issue on their end. And I hope this video is helpful. So please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.